The new Utah State Prison is close to opening. Today, a ribbon cutting ceremony held at the site west of the Salt Lake City International Airport. Fox 13 News political reporter Ben Winslow is there. It's been a long process to complete the new Utah State Prison, which has cost over a billion dollars. But this is like no other facility taking a different approach to prisons. Political leaders cut a ribbon on the new Utah State Prison, a long time coming for the project that started over six years ago. It absolutely was worth it. The new prison cost over a billion dollars to complete. It faced delays and competition for labor, increased costs because of tariffs and supplies. More than 1,500 people worked on it through the pandemic and an earthquake. Absolutely worth it. I think those of us on the inside knew that because of the the increased value of what was going on with the old prison site. But it's like no other prison in the nation. The lower profile buildings blend more into the environment. There's an increased focus on rehabilitation over incarceration. Our staff will have more interaction with those that, that live here that are incarcerated. Um, this facility was also built with programming, education, medical, mental health, all of those are a forethought. Those are all built into the prison and not something trying to be added on after. It has dorm style cells in some areas and utilizes natural light. Some of our current housing units, you walk into those and you don't know if it's daylight, dark. The state has increasingly put more emphasis on changes to the justice system to provide more treatment and resources. At the ceremony, the House Speaker objected to this sign outside the prison gates. The whole purpose of, of investing a billion dollars out here uh, was to help ensure that this facility is not a dead end. Baby. The governor agreed and personally tore it down. It. State officials believe the new prison will also be a benefit to Salt Lake City. And the reason it will is because of what's taking place around this site. Uh, the development that will take place here, and we hope that's manufacturing. Uh, of course, that's in conjunction with the inland ports. But the bigger economic boom awaits the state with the sale of the old prison site in Draper and plans to develop it into a major tech hub and more which will be a huge and unique, uh, really uh, a multi-generational opportunity for our state. It's been a good day. It's, it's been really, a great day. really did well. Now, inmates will be relocated to the new Utah State Prison by the end of this summer for security reasons. The Department of Corrections says it will not say exactly when it will take place. At the new Utah State Prison, Ben Winslow, Fox 13 News, Utah.